completed his 1,500,231st push-up at the 50-yard line of MetLife Stadium to set the world record for most push-ups done in a year. His hard work, dedication, and persistence all to honor the nation's first responders. I mean, these men and women are willing to put their safety, their lives online for us, and I think the, to honor them and to take care of those families if ultimately they pay the ultimate sacrifice, it's a small price to pay. Carroll's journey began on June 14th of 2020 when he partnered with the Tunnel to Towers Foundation to raise money for its fallen first responder program. The New York-based nonprofit provides mortgage-free homes to Gold Star and fallen first responder families who are killed in the line of duty and leave behind young children. So I had to average 4,111 push-ups every day for 365 days. So that's a lot, but I always kept in mind that any stress, any discomfort, any inconvenience that I was experiencing as a result of getting up every day at 345 to knock out my sets of push-ups is small in comparison to what those first responders go through every day, keeping us safe. The Wisconsin father of three also has a personal connection to his mission. He served in the Marine Corps Reserves for seven years, and his two sisters are police officers. I just think it's important that we take a moment to recognize the service that they, they do for us and their ability to kind of put themselves in between us and danger at a moment's notice. Carol passed the world record on June 6th and was fittingly cheered on by fellow first responders in the stands. But his challenge didn't conclude on the football field. Carroll's final total, completed on June 13th, was an astounding 1,506,911 push-ups to commemorate the 20th anniversary of the September 11th terrorist attacks. The push-ups, it's a special number. It was meaningful to me. But the real important number was the money we raised for the foundation. So far, Carroll has raised more than $40,000 for the Tunnel to Towers Foundation. As for how others can help, he says they can simply pay it forward with gratitude. Briella Tomasetti, Fox 5 News.